welcome back to my channel I hope you had a fantastic holiday I just want to show you some of the items I picked up the day after Christmas first I went into Walmart and I found this really nice Mickey Mouse greeter he was normally 1922 everything was 50% off the day after he's got some nice green slag some nice fuzzy plush shoes a really nice sweater and pom-poms on this nice knit scarf really nice Mickey I think we'll end up putting him in front of the Christmas tree just adorable really really love this really cute I found a tree bucket with the Christmas fresh uh, farm fresh Christmas trees on it this was normally uh, $4.97 so this was about $2.50 with the 50% off really nice bucket nice size Mickey into there and I found a few elf ornaments some buffalo check and the classic candy cane stripe and some hats these are about 74 cents I think I got about six of these they also had some really nice lanterns I found a really nice red lantern with a tree on it and this is a nice size this is the medium this is normally five nine or six ninety eight so this is a nice size that actually um, a pillar could go in here or a tea light really nice I found a small galvanized house lantern this was normally $4.98 and I have one of these that I got at the beginning of the season so I was really happy to snag another one and especially at 50% off. I was happy to find this white ceramic large Santa mug. I had seen this earlier in the season, didn't pick it up and was regretting it so I was so happy to at least find one for $1.50. I found some nice gift sets. They had really nice Marvel body wash and bubble bath sets. A Colgate toothbrush set with a PJ Masks. Two different toothbrushes, one manual, one battery operated, full size toothpaste and a brush cap. A three piece Adidas fragrance set that was really nice. That was about $7 with the half off. And holiday cards. This was a nice 32-piece uh, set for $1.50, and there's eight different cards in the set. And I found a seven-foot pre-lit pine Christmas tree for $29, and a three-foot metal snowman stake to stick out in the yard for $10. Next, I went into Macy's and they had actually 70% off and such great deals in Macy's that they barely had any ornaments. I really wanted to find some nice ornaments. They always have something nice. I managed to find four. And the four I found were the only non-damaged that I could find. Uh, I found two of these nice LED lit cabins with a little bottle brush tree and faux smoke from the chimney and um, the faux snow and this top is made out of pine cone really pretty and it has this nice tartan plaid and there's the control for the light but this lights up and this is you know actually large enough that this could be part of a little christmas village really cute so i found two of these and um, two metal, two little galvanized houses with a little heart on top and a cute little buffalo check bow. And um, this was about two or three dollars because this was 70% uh, off. And this one was normally, this was normally 14 really pretty I like both of these houses and I found uh, a really pretty spode travel mug a ceramic with a nice plastic top to prevent spillage very nice it's got holly and berries on one side and then a Christmas tree on the other and this was normally 30 this was uh, $7 normally 30 bucks so 
really nice. The last store I went into was Dollar General. And I found uh, some nice items there. I got this Santa bag for a dollar. They had 50% off at Dollar General there after Christmas as well. Uh, DIY gnome kit. I can only find one of these. A dollar fifty. I thought that was a good deal for um, a DIY gnome. You have everything that you need to make a little gnome. So for a dollar fifty, thought that was really cool. I found some more galvanized goodness at Dollar General. I got this beautiful beautiful bucket with the Merry Christmas and the holly and these really nice red handles really nice and large enough to hold all the Santas I found just love these these were ornaments and these were normally three so I got these for dollar fifty and I think I'm not gonna use these as ornaments I'm gonna have a little collection of Santas on a table and these stand up so I'm gonna have these alongside my other larger Santas. These are really nice. This guy, he's got like some little um, twigs. I think I'm gonna add a bit more greenery here to beef it up to make it look like he's got a small Christmas tree and maybe put it like a small present ornament here so he uh, looks like he really has an armful of nice Christmas stuff. And I found these beautiful black Santas. I really love these. These were normally $8. Um, just really nice detail on these. The face is really nice. I like his suit, his bag of presents. He's got his list here of all the good boys and girls. Really nice. A jingle bell on the bottom of his hat. And this one has just a gorgeous coat this beautiful tartan flat. I really love this. He's got a nice lantern in his hand. Also a bag full of goodies. Jingle bell on his hat. The plaid hat to match the coat in the front. Really, really nice Santa. I just love these so much. These are just really, really well done. I like these Santas a lot better than the Santas that they had at Family Dollar, actually. Dollar General did a really good job on their Santas. And a beautiful ceramic trivet. This was a dollar. Beautiful, gorgeous Christmas red with Merry Christmas, classic. And uh, our favorite red truck with the Christmas tree for a dollar. And then that's how the inside of the bucket looks. Really pretty, glossy, red galvanized. This was normally $6, so I got this for $3. This is so pretty. I really love this. I also found um, a nice red truck for my yard, a lighted piece for the yard with the red truck in the tree.